Today I'm going to show you how to stripe parking lots freehanded, very easy, without a machine, without uh, any equipment, just your hands. Th these are some of the stuff that I brought in, some I didn't use, some I did. Um, this is the paint that I bought at Sherwin-Williams. You, you can also buy the blue one for the um, handicap signs. This is when we finished the uh, the coating, which I'll have another video on that. Uh, a lot of work on that, but uh, simple. So here it is. After the coating went in, you can still see the lines underneath of it, and that's what I did. I just traced the old lines. I'm using a whiz and that gives you like a four inch covering and that's the first coat remember you're gonna have to do probably two coats but three will be best some of you guys might be thinking of putting duct tape down I didn't do that uh, you can use maybe a straight edge you can also use maybe two two by fours, one in each in each side. Uh, I've seen uh, a few people do that before. Um, whatever works for you. If you can keep a straight line like I did, uh, I think it worked pretty good for me. Uh, this paint dries pretty quickly, so you can do probably three coats in a matter of. 20 minutes, half hour or so. It's drying up pretty fast. Uh, temperature out here today is like 72 degrees, and I'm in the northeast. Um, simple. The first coat is not going to look too good. You're going to see the cracks, but the second and third will fill in all these cracks. There you have it. Now I'm going to do the blue. Uh, same process, dries the same, it covers the same, and three coats is best. Uh, I seen the second coat, but it needed another layer to make it look good. Just use a bucket and the strainer, and, and just a regular four inch whiz. There you go folks, beautiful. Everybody loved it, so if you don't have to rent the machine, you know, you can get away with this. Just make sure you don't drop anything on that black top. There you have it. Until the next one.